It is literally like 6 o'clock in the morning and we're about to leave at 6.30 and we're just here at the convenience store getting some coffee before we hit the road. So very excited because we're on our way to Clarence which is in the Free State in South Africa where we are going to be doing a hike. Um, actually two hikes. So it starts the hike this afternoon which is Friday and then we're going to do a hike on Saturday. We can have some fruit and some yogurt for breakfast. This is actually a Woolworths convenience store, so it's really nice. So we're going in a little bus, which is very exciting. arrived at the Golden Gate National Park here in the Free State and look how beautiful these mountains are behind us. Some minerals that are leaching out of the rock from above when the drains or when the water is flowing through. I'm very proud of myself because I set this as a goal. accommodation which is called the Fat Mulberry and it's so cute and I don't know why but for some reason we got the honeymoon suite so that's really like an epic bonus. <music>
to Maiden's Kloof and to do a hike, so looking forward to that. Yeah, let's go. So they have all kinds of facilities here, there's a swimming pool and there's nice bathrooms. Yeah, it is just amazing and you can just hear the water dripping from the little holes in the caves and stuff it's so cool of a pothole which forms because a little stone gets stuck in there you can see the little stone there and then when the water flows it goes around a circle and it wears out this whole area and it makes a pothole so there you can see it There's even a tiny little waterfall behind me if you can see it. tasting. I did not expect that in the free state. We're going to give it a try. This one is Tanat, which is very interesting because the last time I saw Tanat was in Uruguay. And then the gentleman said, yes, it comes from um, a certain part of France and they really liked it and they exported it to South America and it's become their national wine. But yeah, I'm quite enjoying this one.
arrived in Clarence and we're going to do a bit of retail therapy and then we're going to have dinner here in Clarence and it's so quaint. Clarence is actually called the jewel of the free state and it's the third highest village apparently in South Africa um, because I think they said the mountain is something like 1850 so 1850 meters above sea level. Um, yeah, so here it is and I'm going to show you around. It's such a cute place. Clarence is surrounded by this beautiful mountain range, or on one side anyway. I think that's Mount Horeb. So there's actually a shop called Horeb's Butchery or something, and that's why, because that mountain is called Mount Horeb. to head to dinner at a very nice German restaurant here called the Rotterhorn. We're sitting on the couch by the fire and it's so lovely when it's cold outside it's probably like three degrees or something outside and it's so nice and cozy in here. some morning tea look at this view from our room isn't that amazing <music> Yes. Mm -hmm. 